Welcome to UConn Post Game Extra presented by People's United Bank alongside Kara Walters. I'm Gary Apple on Saturday. Number three, Connecticut knocked off St. John's 71 65. Kalina Mosqueda Lewis, a team high 19 points. She had 10 rebounds, and man, she stepped up big, Kara, in the second half. You know, we could take advantage of putting Kalina in the low post. Um, so we did. And, um, you know, she usually responds when when we give her the ball down there and she's really difficult to, to handle one on one. You know, we probably don't don't get clean enough shots. You know, I I'd like to see us get her more shots, but we didn't get a lot of shots for period today. But um, I'm not surprised. I mean that's I watched the game last year that we played and she, she just wasn't ready to play uh, at this level. And today she was completely different than she was last year. I mean she's 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 a lot more confident. Not only doing what she typically does from three point land, but doing it in the post posting up. They didn't have the post presence in Stephanie Dolson, and she really took over in both ways. Kelly Ferris had 17 points, including three three pointers, the last of which her 100th in a Huskies uniform. We talk about the fact that she is a coach's daughter and she plays that sort of uh, fundamental basketball. I was trying to get Kalina the ball as much as I could because she, you know, she was pretty much dominating or getting a foul and getting to the free throw line. Um, but eventually they're going to catch on to that, and they did. And um, I think I got a wide, wide open three. I think Tuck might have set the screen for me. You know, so there was a lot of people who stepped up and did some little, little things that in the end made a difference. She's a coach's dream, and, yes. and you could tell that. She came out a little different in the second half. I think she spoke to her team as a leader, as a senior, and said, guys, this is not acceptable. We're supposed to win and, and win big against teams like this, but St. John's give them credit. But Kelly really stepped up as the leader of the team and took them on her back. We can't play like that. We're going to lose down the road if we play like that against anybody. And um, luckily at the end, we pulled it out because we actually started playing how we know we can play. Um, and there's no room for that now. I think we were just really fortunate. To, to win this game against a really, really good team. Uh, as I said, it's not going to be easy going down the stretch here. So Connecticut now 20 and one on the season, seven and one in the Big East. For Kara Walters, I'm Gary Apple, and don't forget you can catch UConn Post Game Extra presented by People's United Bank after every game right here on SNY.TV.